here that know us and everything. This is independent film. You know, when you spend less than five thousand dollars to make a movie that includes producing, that includes the actors, that includes the beer that you have to have to get through every day. <laughs> so, you know, it's cheap and it's not like a normal movie, but it can still be done. And it's uh, you know, it's fun. There's nothing else I want to do in this world except for this. But that's the best we can do so far. But all the good things come from my uh, cast and crew, and any faults that y'all seen it come from me. So first, let me introduce my cast crew. Uh, Sam, Sam Wise, please come down. <laughs> we have <laughs> uh, David Daniel went missing for a while. Uh, he lost his memory. He came back as an actor. Uh, Sam Wise here, everybody. Uh, next off, I'd like to introduce my screen queen here, Libby Blanton. <laughs> This is probably her least biggest turnout that she's ever had, but you know I'm happy she's here. And then, of course, my red uh, red devil here, Daniel Whitten. Daniel Whitten, uh, four. Put it back on. Two, four of my parents. Four, back four, four of my parents I told you to put it back on. Put it back on. I told you to stay in the truck. Before my parents came, though, I want y'all to know all the cursing in it. It was improv. I didn't write for two of those, uh, the, two of the F bombs. That was it. That was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. So. Also, let's give out a really big shout out to Daniel, real quick, because he's the best production assistant ever. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so um, I'd just like to open up. Anybody have any questions? Well, don't. Go. I got a question. Uh, Not you. Anyone else? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. So, are you. I didn't hear the last part. Are you a casting, casting director? director? Uh, <laughs> we are everything at, yeah. the, at this one. At this level, like I'm serious. Like when I say five thousand dollars, that's at not. At what a level is that exactly? Underground. Like we literally, like I wrote the script, I directed it, me and her edited it. Uh, we cast everybody, which we knew them already. On top of that, they we agree. shot it. Yeah. They so I'm those. saying you don't know me, but like, could I find you on somewhere to like apply for something to like what they're doing? There is like, someone else I have now that does uh, casting directing for me because this one kind of boosts it up a little bit. Uh, I have a man really, over here, Jason. I'm really interested in it. So what Definitely. happened to uh, Joey? See this? Raise your hand, Jason. This over here is our right. management. Uh, hit him up after <coughs> words. He'll be able to get you some information. Hey, what's okay. His name? What's your name? Jason. Jason. Jason what? Huff. Huff. Okay. And thank you because that's the first time I've thank learned how to pronounce so that. <laughs> <laughs> Love the location. Man, Richard. You're here. How many days did it take to shoot? Do what now? How many days did it take to shoot? What is this? Uh, two weeks? Two weeks? Yeah. Yeah, we, we learned very quickly. Uh, smaller cast, smaller timeline. Mm -hmm. uh, the first movie we did, which we were actually selling downstairs right now, it's called Once Upon a Nightmare. Took three months to film, and honestly, a quarter of good as this is. Like, it's not that great. There's scenes in this good, but we uh, had 20 something actors in it. And it was just horrible. Like, it was horrible to film just because it took too much. This one, we had, I think, five actors, two crew members. And just literally took two weeks off from work and filmed it nonstop. That was beautiful. <laughs> yes. Where do you guys film? Because my mother, my mother is planning on. Um, she just got a job with people that are um, filming with uh, movie studios. Studios. Right? Yes. Yeah, That's above us. Um, yeah. There's a lot of like we film a lot of places that we have already. Other ones, we've gotten better now to where we're starting to get permissions. Uh, but half of it is like, you know, you see the cemetery, you see um, the cemetery specifically. We just broke into at midnight and just started filming while we had one person standing at the gate, you know, going, please don't let cops show up. That is pretty much it. No, we break laws to make He says, <laughs> so say, go for it. Thank you, my brother. Uh, I got like three questions. Go for it. I want to know where you got the name of the main character. Can I buy the DVD tonight? And I can't think of the other one. Okay. <laughs> we'll go back. The DVD is not for sale yet. It will be for sale soon. Uh, check out a buckshortproductions.com to keep up with that. On what, on what social media? 
Facebook and the Buckshore Productions as well. That's our biggest one that is on the Facebook account. That's Do you have a website yet? We are yeah, buckshoreproductions.com. Yes. Buckshore Productions website. Okay. And, um, and then the name, of course, goes to my two best friends up there. Uh, Brianna Bagley. Whoa, 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 oh, I'm sorry, B. Bagley. Whoa, 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 whoa. And then David Cairo sitting there. That's where uh, David Bagley comes from. Happy coincidence that it turns out to be dbag at gmail.com. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get it. I'll come back with the third question. Oh, yeah, and also, we're still uh, trying our best to get this. This is our you know, premiere, but we're trying to go further. Downstairs, we have information. If you feel like promoting this movie, we're doing Indiegogo until about mid November. Where's Indiegogo? Indiegogo is uh, independent filmmakers' dream. It's where people give us money to hopefully get our movie seen by everyone that needs to be seen. We take it to different things. Like doing this, I had to front the money to do this. This cost me money. The movie cost me money. The actors cost me money. Everything cost what money. Do we do for you? It gives me money to be able to continue going on to different uh, conventions, to film festivals, to make the movie seen to everyone. So if you're interested in that, definitely come down. We have perks where you can get a pre-sale of a movie. You can get uh, autographs, different things. There's actually a celebrity in this, which I don't know how big y'all are at the horror films, but uh, Misty Monday, the chick who played... Uh, Aaron Brown. Aaron Brown. She played in um, Spider Babe, Lord of the G-Strings. You know, different things that are a little bit out there. Yes. 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 Will you all sign my body? <laughs> no. Nah. 18 and over only. Okay, okay you were in my previous places. It would be like my arm. Um, I promise. It's not inappropriate. We do, uh, we do <laughs> a, a couple of raffles. Anyone that still has their ticket. Uh, listen up. I'm going to let Jeannie do this. This one's for a couple. We have a, We got some autographs from uh, some of our older films that has a lot of autographs. People there making it big. So who's ready for some free stuff? Yeah. 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 Alright. Uh, one, three, one. <laughs> oh, no. Last, 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 last four three. on your little red ticket we gave you. Last three? Yeah, last three. Okay. Yeah. Eight, nine, five. Eight, nine, five. There we go. Yeah. 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 Do I just here. walk down? Yeah. 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 Here, I'll, I'll be yours. You need a runner? I'll be your runner. I'm literally not kidding. You're welcome. Don't worry, there's some heels. Nine one three. Nine one three. Nine one three. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Oh, that's my cousin. 
Alright, so guys, we um, also, we do have DVDs for sale downstairs. We have free photos for everyone that we're willing to sign for this cast. Yeah, they don't watch it. If anyone else wants to say anything, uh, oh, this guy is pretty pretty. Pretty. No, you can't actually pass yeah. for it. It's very traumatic. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, all I was going to say is just <laughs> thank you all for taking your time off and coming to this. I know it's like Halloween or something. So, um, it, just, it means a lot to all of us up here just because the effort we put into it and I know it's not like the top tier thing that everybody's usually used to going to see like someone in the theater but definitely I really appreciate and I know we all do really appreciate and love all of y'all for coming out and like taking the time out of the day to come do this. Do you want to say me? Me? Thanks guys. <laughs> Uh, also, so we'll be downstairs for you know 30 minutes or so. If any people wants to drink with us and buy us a drink before, uh, we're going to Manuel's Tavern afterwards, so keep the party going. I'm riding with you, right? I'm walking. It's like, it's like, oh, it's walking. It's walking. It's walking.